Good morning, Doug. Good morning, Katie. Those migrant families are expected to arrive here in Woburn as early as next week, and already the community is stepping up to help. Piles of clothing and essentials are being collected and organized for this growing need. Churches are also collecting cash donations, formula, and diapers. Woburn city officials say they learned last week that up to 100 migrant families would be coming to the city. Most of them are women and children from Haiti. City leaders are turning a hotel into an emergency shelter. Now the city and state are required to find the migrants housing under state law. Woburn's a welcoming community, um, but there are going to be impacts and costs, particularly at the school level, that uh, you know the state's going to have to, and they are, going to be helping us with those costs. 20,000 migrants have been housed in more than 80 cities and towns in Massachusetts. That number is continuing to grow. And this development here in Woburn comes two weeks after Governor Maury Healy declared a state of emergency for the migrant housing crisis, the migrant crisis here in Massachusetts. She has asked for federal officials to help fund more shelters and services for migrants here in the Bay State. Reporting live this morning here in Woburn, Todd Keskiewicz, WCVB News Center 5.